Pulitzer Prize winning journalist Anthony M. DiStefano has covered organized crime for over three decades, including the crime beat for New York Newsday for the past 20 years. His books on organized crime include Gangland, New York, King of the Godfathers, Mob Killer, The Big Heist, and Top Hoodlum, Frank Costello, Prime Minister of the Mafia. We are very pleased to have him back in the reading room today. This is his second time with us. Um, Anthony, why don't you tell us a little bit about your book? Well, thank you, uh, Susan. The book, Gotti's Boys, takes a look at the organized crime picture in a sort of different way. I tried to show how chance and seemingly unrelated events uh, got together to help propel John Gotti to the position of boss of the Gambino family, uh, which he was, uh, ascended to in 1985. And I'm really focusing on the people who helped him get there. Uh, some of the people are household names, some of them aren't, but they all played a role in propelling him to power, and their stories are just as important and interwoven with John Gotti's story. Of course, you know how the story ends. Uh, none of this really ends very well for any of these characters, but it's really a story that uh, I think encapsulates New York's mafia world in the 80s and 90s, and even into the year 2000 when organized crime was really on its ascendancy uh, in New York. And that's essentially what the book's about. That's great.